The Y's, okay, which one's smaller, top or bottom? The top, right, the eight's smaller. So we're gonna multiply that one. We're gonna say times what? Eight times what gives me 16? Two. Two. Okay, do we need to put a negative? How do you know? They're already opposite. So if they're both negatives or both positives, meaning they're both the same, you need to put a negative on the outside. Okay. So 2 times 6 is going to be 12x plus 2 times 8 is 16y equals 2 times 2 is 4. Okay. Bottom equation, are we changing anything? No. Get negative 8x minus 16y equals 8. Okay, and then we're going to add those two together. 12 plus negative 8. 4x. 16 plus negative 16. Yeah, they cancel. And then 4 plus 8. It's 12. Okay, and then what do we do with that? Divide by four. And some of you guys need to be writing smaller, man. I don't, your paper is all over the place. Okay, so we're going to get three. Okay, where would you like to plug that into? Top or bottom? Top. Top? Okay, and what are we plugging in? The X. So it's going to be six times three plus eight Y equals two. We need to make sure we plug that into the original. Okay, so 6 times 3, 18 plus 8y equals 2. Okay, then we're going to say minus 18. Minus 18. So we got 8y equals negative 16. Okay, and then what? Divide. Divide, and what is my y going to be? Try again. Negative 2. Negative 2. Negative two. What is my solution? 3, comma, negative 2. What is our two vocab words? Solution, what is that? They're going to be on your chest. They're for the bundle. Okay? Oh, yeah. Thank you. Negative two. Good looks. Okay, number three. Do you want to cancel X's or Y's? Okay? If you do the Y's, which one's smaller? The five. Okay, so this one is the one we're going to multiply. Five times what gives me 15? Three. Three. Okay, so top, we're not changing anything. I got 5x minus 15y equals negative 25. Okay, and then on the bottom, I'm going to get 18x plus 15y equals negative 90. Okay, and then we can add these two together. What is 18 plus 5? 20 what? 23 X. What about the Y's? Cancel equals. Huh? Yeah, negative 100. Okay. Okay, so the numbers are higher than 10 right now, right? Don't freak out because you're going to end up dividing. Okay, so um, when we start to do that division, you'll see those numbers shrink. That's what dividing does. Okay, so we're going to say divide by 23, divide by 23. Negative 5. Okay. 
what do you want to do, or what do we need to do with that? Plug it in. Plug it in? Which one do you want to use? Top. Okay, so we got 5 times negative 5 minus 15y equals negative 25. What is 5 times negative 5? Negative 25 minus 15y equals negative 25. Okay, and then what? Add 25, 15. My marker's checking out. Let's see? It's my board. Plus 25, plus 25. So you're going to get negative 15y equals 0. Okay, and then what? Divide. Divide, and what's my y going to be? 0. Zero. What is that solution? Negative five comma zero. Okay, these should go pretty fast, okay? Um, Like Jaquela can't get her work done because you she said you keep texting her and that's why she's on her phone at my work done. eight o'clock in the morning. Okay. She's in like, yeah, that's true. Okay. What's going on? We're gonna call our speakers. Okay, um now she's not up. She that was yesterday. Go grab water. Okay. Um okay, so number five. What uh do you want to cancel? What do you want to cancel? Okay, if we do the y's, which one's smaller? The 10 or the 20? The 10. So that's the one we're going to multiply by. 10 times what gives me 20? Huh? Huh? You don't stop talking. I know. I'm trying to do my work. I know. Two. Okay, do we need a negative or not? Yes. Okay, negative 16x minus 20y equals 24. And then the bottom, we're not changing anything. I got 7x plus 20y equals 12. Okay, and then what do we do with that? Add them together. Negative 16 plus 7. Negative 9x. The y's cancel. And then I got 24 plus 12. 36. Divide by 9. Yep, negative 4. We get x equals negative 4. We got B for something that's any good. I don't know. I just came in the building and people cooked. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I don't I know. Like that. I'm, that's what I'm saying. Like, there's plenty of other math classes, though. Oh. Hostility in my home. Room. This heading. Yeah, he can come over. Uh, can he just stay? Can he just stay? Uh, oh, okay, because he, he, I'll have to show him. Okay, thanks. Okay, which one do you want to plug in? Bottom. Bottom? 
Okay, so I'm gonna get seven times negative four plus 20y equals 12. Okay, so it's gonna be negative 28 plus 20y equals 12. We're gonna add 28. So I got 20y equals something, 40? Thanks. Okay, and then we're gonna divide, and what's my y gonna be? Two. So what's my solution? Negative four comma two. Okay, seven. What do you want to cancel? No, you got to pick X's or Y's. X? Okay, which one's smaller? The bottom. Okay, one times what gives me two? Two. Do we need a negative? Hmm? Yeah. Okay, so top, we're not changing anything. Bottom is gonna be negative two X minus four Y equals eight. Okay, and then we can add these together. So you're gonna get one plus negative four. It's gonna be negative three y equals negative five plus eight. Three. Okay, what's my y gonna end up being? One. Negative one. Okay, and then you want to plug that in on top or bottom? Top. Top? Okay, so you're going to get 2x plus my y is negative 1 equals negative 5. Okay, then what? You're gonna add one, okay? So, um, really, see how I have a plus minus? That minus definitely trumps this plus. So, we're gonna add one to both sides. Okay, so I'm gonna get two X equals negative four. Okay, and then what's my X gonna be? Negative two. Okay, so what's my solution? Good. Okay, you guys have eight to do on your own. Okay, you're gonna do, um, remember 14 through 16 is extra credit. You're gonna do nine and 11 and then all the, the even, okay? You're more than welcome to work with a partner, okay? Get them done and then put it in the box.